Another armor now too. That's good shit. Look at these mags I have now, dude. I have mags for days. Mags for days. That's what I'm talking about. Six shotguns. I do need a torch with me. I do, yeah. I like how I can't make a torch. I gotta buy some cloth. You have 7.8 million Hux, Volpe. That should be illegal. How do you know you're close to finishing Breathage? I imagine so. That's just a guess. I could be completely wrong, though. So, uh, do I run... Wait, I could take the hole to the quarry and then run to the swamp cottage then up there. Yeah, that, that that's a game plan. That's a game plan. Let me see. What do I need to prepare in my base? Uh, both traps are full there. Boom, boom. That's boom. Okay, one trap got done here. That's fine. Fuck it. Like Alien Isolation. Yeah, that game is unfinishable. Almost. Good. I do believe we're fine. Uh, I'll take the hole, go down, try to chat with them, see if anything happens. Yeah, Alien Isolation drags on for way too long. Hey man, after a while of nothing, I managed to get offered a great job today. Yo, congrats, Cobble. Cheers, dude. It's water, but yeah. Of course I will, Ninja Axe. Of course. What the fuck is that? Is that the guy that keeps digging the holes? Oh, it is. Yeah, he's not hostile. I didn't- I've never seen him do that. I've actually never seen that. Uh, key zero. I did free the snail. Yeah, I've done it in a few playthroughs. Or one playthrough. <laughs> Gossip. I remember... Wait, this is the mom. Fuck, I don't know what she talks like. I remember one loitering around here. He used to be a doctor. Hey, you. He would come to the village to treat people. Now he looks like an unholy pig. Face smothered in shit. Dressed in rags. This devilish disease finally gets to everyone. You better watch out or you'll lose your mind too. He left towards the northwestern part of the swamp. Photo of a family. That was a long time ago. A long, long time ago. The woman silently hands me back the photo. Well, that was fucking pointless. Let's try to go to the, um, the mushroom lady. I don't think I'm missing any item here. Oh, fuck me. I didn't find the drawings yet. 
yeah. And he painted mushrooms. You gotta show this. Yeah, you gotta show this to the goddamn mushroom lady. Uh, maybe I can show it to her. No. All right, let's go up to her. Boom. You were about to eat her grandma? Maybe I'll eat her anyways, Anthony Carmine. Chorpor, almost 50. Yeah, dude. Did you finish the most recent Nautica playthrough? I did, yeah. I did, I did. Hey, you. Zale, thanks for the seven, yo. Thank you. AP rub on the on the grandma. Some Mississippi grind. Hey, you. Ella's mental health sure took a dive after he stopped speedrunning Dark Souls. Hey. If I was still doing it to this day, I wouldn't have any hair. So I'll take that trade, alright? Of course, Varian. Of course, that. Show item. Child's drawing. Photo family. My child! She went into the woods and never came back. I look for her, but my legs won't work how they used to. Child's drawing. The old lady takes the drawing, squinting her eyes. A wide, toothless smile appears on her face. Oh, that's why you came here? The woman looks at this leaky ceiling of the mushroom infested house. Then squints her eyes. I thought you were like this wolf. The end of her cigarette lights up and pulls off a blue smoke comes out of her nose. From that children's tale, the one who wanted to eat the granny. Oh, oh. She opens her eyes and glances at the locked chamber room. A few days ago, a child appeared here. A oh boy. He thinks I'm his granny. The old lady stops for a second, trying to remember something. Grandma? He was very he was very nervous. He kept repeating a rhyme over and over again. He hid in the corner and sat there for what must have been the whole day. I think he relaxed in the end. He seems to like it here. He draws. I think he likes to draw, but his drawings are not very childlike. She smiles again. I really like having him around. His parents are still alive, right? Are you his father, brother? He's in the other room. Here's the key. I'll let him go if he wishes to go with you. Hey, let's go, dude. Kid, you're coming with me. The boy is standing under a wall overgrown with enormous mushrooms. He's visibly scared. His lush mop of hair veils a restless wide open pair of eyes. The kid is whispering as if reciting something under his breath. The boy cowers and presses his back against the soft wall, which starts to ooze a white goo. Kneel and extend your arm towards the boy. Leave the boy in peace. Extend the arm. The boy is terrified. Slowly he slumps down from the wall to the ground, curling into a ball. The murmur turns into a loud recitation. One little bear ate a bowl of soup, then another bear came and there were two. Four little bears made a sudden pow. 
along come the fifth and took a little bow. Put the boy on your back and lead him to his family. Hey, you. When I take the boy into my arms, he starts screaming, reciting the rhyme over and over again. One little bear ate a bowl of soup. Then another bear came and there were two. Four little bears made a sudden pow, along with fifth and to come and take a little bow. It's going to be a long journey. Please, leave him be. He doesn't want to go. Can't you see? The old lady suddenly tries to stand up from her armchair, but, f but fails. Ah. Uh, leave him at once. Do you he? I hear a sudden creak. It's the armchair together with the old lady falling to the ground. Her head smashes against the ground, shattering into pieces. Her thin arms break like dry twigs. A colorless goose seeps from her body. The boy falls silent. All I can feel is his little fist hitting my back and his faint cry. And you brought my child back. The woman leaned towards the boy. Marcin, where have you been? The boy stares at the ground in silence. Come here. Marcinic walks towards the woman, nervously plucking at his old torn sweater. Look at you. Where's your mask and the gas tank from your gracious brother? His love protects us. It fills our lungs with clean air. And this is how you thank him, young man? Your childish behavior made him very, very angry. Now we'll have to apologize for him to your stupidity. For, yeah, whatever. The two kids standing behind their mother flinch. The, wo the woman grabbed the boy's hand and disappears in the hallway. After a while, she comes back with an oxygen tank. Take, take it. It's a tank for you. It will protect you from this devilish air. The devil's breath and other evils lurking in a foul place. It's the only thing I have and the only thing I can give you. Tank is a little rusty, but it seems intact. On the side, I can see some unintangible scribblings. The valve opens with a little resistance, but I don't hear the hiss of air. It's empty. Do not open the valve without need. You'll only waste the clean air. She pushes my hand away from the valve and closes it hastily. Made serve you well. Okay, so we actually have a oxygen tank now, but it's empty. So where the fuck do you refill it? Haven't I seen that? Haven't I seen like a refiller? I think that's just, is that at base? I feel like yeah I, yeah 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 it's in the, yeah I, I think I know where it is I think I know where it is. Uh, chat, you can post all you want about my voice acting, but I'm actually ha happy with it, okay? It makes myself more immersed in the game. Yeah, exactly. Chat, chat, when I'm in the next Pixar movie, we'll, we'll see what about your pastas then, huh? Back to Granny. Oh, God. Yeah, I will when I go for a shopper. Last time you voice acted something, you got 200 dislikes on YouTube. Can't meme here. <laughs> it's this right here, this thing. What the fuck? Oh, bro. 
Uh, I don't have that. Oh, man. Or I'm blind. I have a chicken head. Good night, we'll be so well, dude. Have a good one. Well, I'm gonna keep exploring to the right then. I can finish the game, Austin. All I have to do is go to a specific area, and I know where. But I am not going to do that, because I want to do the, like, the snail and stuff. That's a dangerous enemy, that one, dude. Where'd you go? There's no escape. All right. Oh, you need... Oh, okay, cool. You need oxygen tanks? I actually forgot about that. Oh, hey, would you look at that? Photo of three boys. Thief. Nothing else here? There is another room here, but nothing I can get to here. Unless it's over here. No. No, though. Don't touch that one. Okay. What? Hey! Open up! Alfield the Odin! Yo, shit! Thanks for the raid. Oh, God. Hope you had a good stream. Thank you. Thank you. Knife. I never use it because... Oh, God. What the fuck is happening here? Oh, my God. 
Alcohol, though, is good shit. Yo. There is a dude here. I am indeed Swedish. Did you just call me Sw Oh, you're a Swedish VTuber. I thought you called me a Swedish VTuber. I was like, what? Uh, uh -uh. Oh god. Is this where I came from? I... Yeah, I've been here. Yeah, I think I'm finito here, maybe. I can't remember. Wait, I haven't been here. Never mind. It's getting late, though. I have to go home. Yeah, I want to maybe do the God of War Marathon all in uh, March now. Shit. You asshole. What are you looking at, huh? Ah! Shit, I gotta go home. I gotta go home. What do I ditch this? Go. Go, go, go. You have no time to lose here. I gotta keep looting this next morning. Oh my. Oh, use that firing a shot. It's trash. Use the drugs, man. Come on. Oh god, how do I get out of here? Chat? Don't. Don't, 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 please. I need to get the fuck out of here. Leave me alone. Oh my god. SMH. Just go left. I ain't gonna die now. Nah, 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 nah. I don't think so. I'm home. And we're good. And safe. Great. No gas? I got gas, dude. We're good. We're good. We're good. We got plenty.
I got nails, man. We're good. Oh my god, I can't store anymore. <laughs> Dude, I gotta sell a bunch. Oh, this is creepy. I should make Molotovs, man. But I need cloth for other stuff, though. Yeah, no, I'm just gonna end up killing myself. Murder white people, happy torture, white people, happy blood, white people, happy death, white people, happy friends, white people, happy. <laughs> yeah, something like that, Mario. Thank you. Okay, are we ready for night number whatever it is? It is 20? Oh god, here we go. Why do I have a trap on me? Yes, five head. That's not a trap. Uh, those of you who just joined in the raid, this is Darkwood. It's a very difficult game. I finished it a few times, but I have never managed to finish it on permadeath mode. Uh, I'm close though. I've never been this close before. The thing is, every night at 8 p.m., because you can see top right, you have to survive. And it can get extremely difficult. Oh no. No. Why? This means a banshee is gonna spawn, and banshees are bad news. Hey, you! There's two of them! Uh... Hey, you! Don't come in here. Fuck. Don't. Oh my god, she is. Wait, I got ghosts at the same time as Banshees? Okay, where is she? Oh fuck this, chameleon. Oh no! Hello? Okay. Okay. No, she's behind me. Yep. Oh, God. No, my fucking... My lights. Uh, <laughs> what? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. I have... A There's three of them! Jump over the fuck! Moth, moth, moth. Dude, dude, they're just like fucking marching in! No! God, I need light! The ghosts kill you if you don't have light. No, I. I can stand here, I can stand here. 
Come on, two and a half more hours. You can kill them, but I'm not going to risk it because I don't have any fire. They're weak against fire. What the fuck is fuck? It's because I'm not in house.